this. Watch this. Science fiction films have always featured time travel. Imagine visiting the dinosaur era in the past or the Milky Way Andromeda galaxy collision in the future. The effects of speed and gravity on time are explained by Einstein's theory of relativity. At speeds close to the speed of light as well as around enormous objects like black holes, neutron stars, etc., time slows down noticeably. If a 15-year-old guy spent 5 years in space at 99.5% the speed of light, he would return to Earth at the age of 20, while his classmates would be 65. Or, to put it another way, the boy would have gone into the future. Similar to this, one can visit the future by spending some time near a black hole because time moves more slowly there. Achieving such high speeds or traveling to a black hole is not possible using current technology but it may be possible in the future. Astronauts abroad the ISS travel to the future because ISS orbits Earth at high speeds 7,660 meters per second. Astronauts that spend one year at the ISS travel 0.014 seconds to the future after returning back to Earth. Einstein's theory of relativity readily allows for time travel to the future, ignoring the technological aspects. But is it possible to travel back in time? In this video we present two possible ways that would allow us to travel back in time. Since we do not live in the Marvel Universe, using the time stone is not an option. Faster than light. Traveling close to the speed of light, causes time to slow down, and time ultimately stops at the speed of light. But what would happen if you travel faster than light? According to theory of relativity, under some circumstances, traveling faster than light would allow you to travel back in time. But this isn't practically possible. An infinite amount of energy, would be needed to make a spacecraft travel faster than light. Light is the fastest known entity in the universe and it is believed that no object in the universe can ever travel faster than light. Dachyon A hypothetical particle, always travels faster than light. If dachyons exist, they could travel back in time, but most physicists believe that faster than light particles, cannot exist because they are not consistent with the known laws of physics. Also, the existence of tachyons would require them to have an imaginary mass. Wormholes. Wormholes are predicted by Einstein's general theory of relativity. Wormholes are theoretical passages that, connect two different points in space-time. A wormhole would allow you to travel from one galaxy to the other in no time. The most notable example of the wormhole, can be seen in the interstellar movie where Cooper and his crewmates travel to another galaxy, through the wormhole constructed by the future humans near Saturn. Wormholes can not only link two different points in space but, also link two different points in time. Thus, a wormhole could allow you to travel back and forward in time. However, construction of a traversable wormhole, would require the existence of a substance known as negative matter. Without negative matter, the wormhole would rather be unstable and collapse. In the same sense, that charge can be negative or positive, negative matter, would have a negative mass, say minus one kilogram. There is no evidence for the existence of negative matter currently. Although we could actually save ourselves the stress of traveling through a wormhole, or building a jet engine faster than the speed of light, and simply use a teleporting machine to go further and backwards it will. Unfortunately, this technology is still a working progress. While human teleportation currently exists only in science fiction, teleportation is possible now in the subatomic world of quantum. Scientists, from the Hasso Plattner Institute in Potsdam have invented a real-life teleporter system, that can scan in an object and beam it to another location. Not quite the dematerialization and reconstruction of science fiction, the system relies on destructive scanning and 3D printing. But is it possible in distant future to use black holes as a means of time travel? Well, that is a topic for another video, stay tuned. Hope you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to this channel. Would you like to travel back in time? Let us know in the comments section. If you have any doubts or you have more ideas on this topic, please share your thoughts in the comments section. Thanks for watching.